This is the Cash Machine Con. It's lovely. Yeah, yeah. This is good, isn't it? In yeah. the den, the boys assemble the fake cash machine. You're gonna hook this up to the uh, computer, right? Yeah. yeah. We need to have a screen from here, and also here. Camera. Camera, yeah. That's perfect. Making Camera sure perfect. every Pin. last detail looks authentic. You hit the space bar, enter your pin. We get the pin from the keyboard there. Please wait while we process your request. Just wait as long as you want. Right, John, let's go. Once the paint's dry, the hustlers assemble the plywood cash point and place it in a spot with plenty of passing pedestrians. But each time they put their card in, it's rejected. The reason's simple. Normal cash machines are supposed to be full of money, but this one is designed to hide a hustler. Thank you. Thank you. Oh. All right. Yeah. That's fine. Bye. Watch your fingers. Inside the cramped box, Jess has the laptop which controls the display screen of the cash machine and a magnetic card reader able to copy bank card details. It's also equipped with a small camera to record pin number entries. But she doesn't have long to wait. It only takes a few minutes for an unsuspecting victim to approach the machine. As soon as he inserts his card, Jess springs into action. While she quickly processes the card in the laptop, Paul keeps watch outside just in case the mark realizes the box is dodgy. Jess quickly posts the mark's card back out of the machine. Frustrated that the cash point's not working, he goes in search of another ATM, unaware that he's just been scammed. Even though the cash point only appeared in the street a few minutes ago, it takes just seconds for another mark to try to withdraw money. Again, Jess takes the card and changes the display to ask for a PIN number. Jess now has enough information to clone her card, clear out her bank account and go on a shopping spree at the mark's expense. Another unsatisfied customer. Ever the thoughtful accomplice, Paul makes sure Jess doesn't dehydrate in the cramped oh, box. Yeah, thank you. There's a lot more cars to clone before Jess can stretch her legs. She's got her work cut out just keeping up. In a very short time, this scam can earn the hustlers tens of thousands of pounds. After just two hours, the hustlers have collected the account information and PIN numbers of 25 unsuspecting cardholders. 